we need to get the sheep out of Wonderland. Uh, because they're stuck in it. It's, it's a land of wonder. Of course, wonder, when you look at the word, it's just nothing really. It's just keeping you distracted. And that's what we're stuck in. Not all the majority of people are stuck in complete wonderland, you know. There's no realism or, or like getting through to them. Not when the, the electronic entrapments have got them, the, the electronic gadgetry and stuff like that. Uh, you, you just can't break through the people, unfortunately. It's not happening. Um, of course, the, the system is cleverly um, pushing liberal agendas now. But if you look at like um, the extreme left, what you'll find is it's just the basic same as the right and the extreme right. So that the, the extreme left is under the guise of uh, multiculturalism. And if you say, look, well, um, quite frankly, our country kind of like sustain its own people, let alone like people from Romania, Russia, and I don't know where else, like in Slovakia, you know, uh, Bulgaria, fucking Hungary, keep just fucking peasants from everywhere. We've got our own peasants to deal with. And the fight isn't here for these people. The fight should be in their own country. They should be fighting back against their own government and their own system and trying to create what they want and their desired life in their own country. So it's all about like Tower of Babel shit again, where you're walking down a street and nobody even speaks fucking English and, and they're in England for fuck's sake. I mean, it's ridiculous. Um, if you want an, a version of the extreme left, have a look at multiculturalized Sweden and how it's been. Uh, it was once a beautiful fucking country, which I visited um, many moons ago and how it's been completely destroyed by diversity and like rape gangs and fucking um, Muslim fucking nutcases walking around looking at blonde pretty women and just ganging up and raping them. And this is a sad fact of life that I think it's done on, on purpose and it's definitely done by design that the agenda is to open the, the, the gates and create this sense of um, losing one sovereignty, losing your country's sovereignty and just basically you don't know where you stand in life and you're not sure what's going on anymore. It's again, it's the old trick that they always fucking do. Always, always do it. And that's the order from the chaos that they're creating and they want the chaos. They know that people that aren't going to adapt with living next door to people from this country, that country, it, it doesn't really work. It's never going to work. But of course, you're labeled as racist for even mentioning it. And that's the extreme left. And that's the other side of the fascism, um, which is, you know, just as, as severe, really. So both sides of the spectrum, the left or right, the same thing when you get into the extremity of it. And political correctness and all this weird fucking, uh, you, you must accept fucking transgender people. And this is, this is the extremity of liberalism that goes too far. Like, you, you know, like they, they'll teach your children in school that they, that it's, it's not Adam and Eve, it's Steve and Bob now, <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, or it's Adam and Eve and Eve was once, um, a man or it was, um, Oh, you see what I'm getting at, yeah. It's just it's just getting mad, blurring the sexes up, the rise of feminism, creating um, divisions between the sexes. It, it's just it's just relentless, man. It just doesn't fucking end. And there's there's no logic or, or sanity towards this anymore. It's just a relentless agenda, and it, it it doesn't really give a shit about people that are thinking like, wait a minute, you're pushing this forward. Let, let's have a take a step back and let's look at it again. Nah, no saying it anymore. And they use the, the people as pawns in this kind of brigade because they police the people to police the people, you know what I mean? So the people come out and lambast anyone that says, oh, wait a minute, I'm against this kind of too far liberal thing. They'll say, no, 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 you're racist, you're this, you're that, you're that. And the, 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 the lambasting and name calling comes out and all this stuff and we're going back to a fucking schoolyard and not being adults or fucking even looking at reason and logic anymore. We're going back to a, a, a civilization that's just gone mad again. And the insanity doesn't seem to stop, whether it's on the right or the left, it just continues and plows ahead, you know. Um, so, just try and stay sane, that's all I can recommend. Keep keep your fucking, your head sharp, your head's like a, a sword, isn't it? You have to keep sharpening, you have to keep thinking, you know, don't let them say that too, think too much thinking is too bad. No, no, fuck that. 
you got to think, you got to really think about like what do you want and where do you want to be and, and what's the future in this fucking crazy rock. Anyway, I must be racist or sexist or fucking misogynistic or whatever the fucking label they want to say. I'll fucking give, give them all, give us all your fuck labels, couldn't give a fuck man, you know. See you later.